You should have acted. They're already here. The Elder Scrolls told of their return. Their defeat was merely a delay. Until the time after Oblivion opened. When the Sons of Skyrim would spill their own blood. But no one wanted to believe. Believe they even existed. And when the truth finally dawned, it dawns in fire. But there's one they fear. In their tongue is Dovakin, Dragonborn. Course, 400 gold for a hero match. Well done.
Nightcrawler. You have really impressed everyone, including our current Grand Champion. He has requested a match with you, so we are going to forego the customary procedure and let you fight. And I hereby promote you to Gladiator. Make no mistake, this Khajiit is champion for a reason. He is one tough opponent. I hope you're ready for this. Follow me. Ladies and gentlemen, we have something special for you for our last match. Yeah. Grand Champion has returned to Skyrim! Please welcome back to the pit, Subra! <laughs> and our challenger from the blue team, please welcome back, Wolfsong! Take your positions and let the match begin! Five hundred gold for defeating a champion. I wouldn't have believed it if I didn't see it with my own eyes. Well done. Findet eigentlich jeder etwa. Seid gegrüßt. Für manche ist es Ramsch. Für mich sind es Schätze. Wenn ihr etwas aus Kaum Stahl ist die besten Waffen und Rüstungen. Sucht mich in meiner Schmiede, wenn ihr Waffen oder eine Rüstung benötigt.
Oi, did you ever? We haven't had a challenger that exciting. Oh, since... Oh, I can't remember when. Oh, uh, yes, uh, of course I am. But I'm sure you can see how addictive it can become, can't you? My, you do have a short temper, don't you? Why so angry? Well, you'll get your lumber soon enough. Please tell Mr. Janus I will have a shipment out for him tomorrow. No one is getting swindled by me. Oh yes, that. How about the first two shipments are free of charge? And I can take off, say, 10% for the rest. Here is a new contract for Mr. Janus. Please give him the warmest regards, will ya? You're right. Goodbye. Good that the war is finally over. Hopefully, the people of Skyrim can resume their lives in peace. What? New contracts? Discounts, you say? What happened? Maybe so. But I'll bet it will make for quite a tale to tell your grandchildren around a campfire someday. <laughs> ah, how I envy you. If only I were but a younger man. Forgive my mindless ramblings of younger days. It's just an old soldier's dreams. Anyway, this says... You will receive a considerable savings. And the shipments will begin immediately. Well done. Now we can get that old inn finished. And start on the rest of the town. No, you've worked yourself out of a job with me. And again, thank you. But I believe Valerius has more information for you. Please, see him at your earliest convenience. at this time. Harbinger of the Companions. Word gets around, friend, and they're certainly fortunate to have you. Yes, I wanted to be absolutely certain before I spoke with you, but it's been confirmed by my sources. There is indeed a slavery network in operation here in Skyrim, and all clues point to my old nemesis Arendil as its chief operator. They're capturing citizens, whole families, and even their children, and selling them as slaves. I'm afraid only the gods know what's happening to these poor souls after that. Arundel has certainly covered his tracks well, so we have very little, if anything, to go on. All we know is that he specifically requested a transfer here, and to be assigned as overseer of all prison operations in Skyrim. I would 
was certainly convenient, was it not? Be that as it may, fortunately one of their guards had loose lips at precisely the right moment. And you may remember Korst saying he spoke of his relationship with some whore at the Tallmast Tavern. I know, it's not much. But maybe she can provide us with something else to investigate. Can you see what you can find out from her? Here, I'll mark it on your map. Handsome, I only provide one kind of service here. And information, ain't it? Besides, I never kiss and tell. What you see is what you get with me, sugar. So, if you're not interested in my company, I suggest you go to the bar and leave me be. Well, baby, if you're feeling that generous, maybe I know a little. But I was hoping to get to know a handsome man like you a little better. Oh, that lean body and muscles. Oh, oh, such a pity. I might even spend some time with you for free someday. About him? Nothing much. He's been here to see me a time or two. Not very, uh... Impressive, if you ask me. But that's another story. Hold on, sweetie. I'm getting to it. All I really know is that another one of the girls said someone else came in here looking for him yesterday. She said instead of a tall mast, he was more like a limp sail. <laughs> but she said he sure did his share of talking. I guess if you can't be good at... Well, you know, something else. Talking is the next best thing. She said he was one of those kind you wouldn't want to tell any secrets to, if you know what I mean. He said his name was Manin. Anyway, he said he would be taking a ship out of solitude back home soon. For all I know, he might still be there. Now, if you don't need me for anything else, I have customers to take care of. Mmm, that's a pity, honey.
sagt, dass ich Rockwear nie mehr wiedersehen werde. Aber er wollte mir nicht verraten, warum. What? Who? You must be mistaking me for someone else. I know no one by that name. <coughs> What? That's absolutely preposterous. Yes, yes, I know who you are. I mean, who doesn't know about the hero of Skyrim? Very well, I will talk. But only if you guarantee me you'll let me sail back home. I don't know. I never met him, actually. I only met with one of his... associates. An odd bandit named Gunlock. Some say his last name is Forktongue. But I wouldn't know about that for sure. All I know is that Erendil sends the um, product to Gulag and he takes care of getting them smuggled out of Skyrim. I don't know exactly where he is, but I know they smuggle the product out of Skyrim from an old shipwreck in the coast northwest of here. I heard they used an old frozen cave to hold the product, and then used boats to transfer them out to one of their ships at night. My shipment is supposed to be on its way there now. I swear to you, that is all I know. No, I suppose it won't. Not now, at least. Yes, yes, of course. As I said, I've already made those arrangements. You needn't worry about that. Now then, I'll take my leave of you. Ihr könnt euch gerne etwas wünschen. In unruhigen Zeiten gibt es nichts Besseres als ein schönes Lied, um die Stimmung zu heben. Wenn ihr Gerüchte wollt, seid ihr bei Korpus am besten aufgehoben. Ich habe aber einen Besucher gesehen, der auf dem Weg zum Blauen Palast war. Vielleicht solltet ihr hier übernachten. Corpulus führt ein sauberes Gasthaus. Lasst es mich wissen, wenn euch etwas gefällt. Ah, werft einen Blick darauf. Endlich. Lasst mich alles stehen. Hättet ihr vielleicht um etwas Gold für einen Veteran? Hier findet eigentlich jeder etwas. Sagt Bescheid, wenn ihr euch gefallen habt. Bayram, werft einen Blick drauf. Ihr seid im Kram mit Charme jederzeit willkommen. Bei euren Einkäufen kann ich euch helfen, aber wenn ihr reden wollt, solltet ihr euch um meine Schwester helfen. Anscheinend die besten Waffen und Rüstungen. Ihr könnt jederzeit zurückkommen, wenn ihr Waffen oder Rüstungen braucht. Hallo und wir werft einen Blick darauf. Kommt doch bald mal wieder vorbei. einen gefangenen Drachen freizulassen. Das werde ich mein Leben lang nicht...
todavía. Wo seid ihr? Nun ja, ist wohl weggelaufen. Yes! <laughs> 